<laughs> Interesting. <laughs> These are very nice. I still like the black one the best, but it's okay. It's okay. Wow, you can just buy all these things right here. Getting lots of stairs. I am excellent. How are you? <laughs> it's okay. Twenty is okay. <sighs> and what is that? Cambodian donut. Cambodian donut. <laughs> I landed in Phnom Penh. Uh, around four in the morning, maybe it was five or yeah five, and I had to wait outside my hotel. They weren't open yet. I had to wait out there for two hours, just on a bench. I was kind of like a homeless person, just sleeping on a bench with all my stuff. It's very uncomfortable, but got into my room, slept for a couple hours, and this is my first time outside exploring. Um, I was not really sure where to go. I watched a bunch of YouTube videos. I didn't really seem interested in going to the, you know, like the museums yet or anything like that. So I found a square right in the middle on Google Maps and decided to walk to it. That took me to the Central Market and it is interesting over here. Um, so it's a big square, but it's all surrounded by a bunch of different um, types of things to sell. So you'll see right now when I walk in, like literally, this is where I came from, one of the sides and there's fruits and vegetables. You see a lot of shrimp, dried shrimp over there. Um, but very quickly it transforms into the seafood. There's lots of different seafood, squid. I don't even know the names of all these different fish. Look at this, living shrimp, is that shrimp? If they are, they're huge. I don't know what those are, they're massive. Let's check out this side where there's even, even more. Wow, look at those things. What the heck is that? Crabs. Ooh, blue crab. Super blue. More squid. Lots and lots of squid. Whoa, look how big these crabs are. These are eels. <laughs> they look like they're pretty cooped up in there. I think that's a geo, geo something. I've seen people eat those. Yeah, it's pretty intense. Oh my gosh, look at those things. There's so many in there. <laughs> Interesting. Wow, you can just buy all these things right here. It's like I'm at an aquarium. As you can see, there's lots of fish, but that's not all that there is here. This whole building in the middle, I think is the central market but it is absolutely surrounded on all sides by different shops and it changes from clothes to food to fish to uh, jewelry, all kinds of different things. And the smells change very, very quickly. So I'm at the entrance right now, but I'm actually gonna go around to the side because when you walk around to the side, it's completely different and we barely even walked very far. So here, now I'm looking at lots of clothes, bras, this is lots of slippers, Chanel. <laughs> All right, which way? It's really easy to get lost in here. All right, now I'm out of the clothes and it's more like beauty supplies, I think. Well, not quite. These are candles. But then yeah, over here there's lotions and uh, toothpaste, toiletry stuff, hand wash stuff. I don't know how else to call it. Toiletries, but there's lots of it. Stuff to wash. Just keep going around. All right, so now as I turn the corner, it's actually like beauty slums. There's people here getting their hair done. 
getting her nails in at the same time. And she's getting a pedicure over here. I think that is a card reader. I think that's what this is. What is this? No? <laughs> okay. I guess it's not. But there's several of them. Hmm. No, no. Yep, more nail stuff. This is uh, lots of uh, tarot readers. Have people eating food over here. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I am excellent. How are you? <laughs> Have a very nice day. How old are you? How old? <laughs> You're five years old? Yeah. I'm six years old. <laughs> Have, Have a nice day. Bye. Bye. She was cute. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna keep walking. Whoa. You're just shredding full blocks of ice in seconds. That was cool. Never seen that before. Looks like we have a bunch of snacks all along the side, dried fruits. And then more clothes. So yeah, we are around the outside. I'm not sure if we're on the northeast, south, or west edge. You can see all the shop owners are just hanging out inside. There's certain parts inside where there was just, uh, everyone was sleeping here. I'll, I'll go in right here. Cooking, cooking ware. <laughs> Plates. Forks and spoons. Wow, a lot of stuff in here. Everything's so shiny. Pillows, carpets. It's really cool how you just walk a short distance and everything changes. There's, there's so much stuff here. Now, more cooking stuff, which is a little bit different. So let's go into this entrance. And now we're in the center, the actual central part of this building. So we've got a clock right in the middle huge dome structure and then lots and lots of what it looks like to be jewelry oh i think this is like an electronic section over there so yeah sunglasses look at all these all this jewelry yeah so the whole center area is all just surrounded by lots and lots of jewelry I am not really interested in that right now, so I think I'm gonna head over to this electronics area. Hmm? Rolex? Where? Oh, over here? High quality? Ah. Black color, green color. Oh. At four colors. Four colors? How much is this? 55? dollars for the Rolex. Can I see the black one? I like black better. Wow, okay, so a black Rolex for $55. It's a pretty good deal. And honestly, like there's a plastic on it right now, but it, I'm not I'm not a Rolex expert or anything, but it looks like a pretty good Rolex. Can you do it for 20? No. La. No, two. 20 only battery, battery is 20 dollars, it's not automatic. 20? Okay, no. Oops. It's not automatic, cannot 20 dollars. Mm. Yeah. Okay, good price for you. Okay, 45 for you. Okay. 45? Yeah. That's better. 45 for you, okay, 45. Hmm. I think I'll keep looking for, for cheaper. Cheaper, have no cheaper. A cheaper, cheaper. This is very nice. I still like the black one the best, okay. Okay. but it's okay. It's How okay. You can't do 20? No. 
Uh, it's okay, I'll keep looking. Okay, the price will be okay. 40 dollars? Yeah. Very cheap, you know. Not the same. Mm. Okay? No, it's okay. It's okay. That's too much. That's okay. It's okay. I I already have a watch here, so I'll just keep I'll just keep looking. How much can you the price okay? It's okay. I was thinking 20, but I don't I don't No. It's okay. I'll keep looking. Thank you very much. Have a good day. 30? <laughs> No, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I walk away now. No, it, it's okay. Twenty is okay. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep going. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. Okay, so she was going to give me the Rolex for twenty dollars. Uh, so if anyone's in the market for a twenty dollar Rolex, you know where to go. Central Market in uh, Phnom Penh, Cambodia. If I wasn't going on lots of plane flights, I would totally check out these knives. Flashlights, tripods. I might need a tripod. I'm okay right now, thank you. We have kids toys, more tripod. Ooh, see, I might need to get one of these. Oh, we're back to clothes. Cameras. Oh wow, full on Nikons in here. Lots of cameras back there. Look at all these motorbikes. Everyone's got motorbikes out here. I hear that the motorbikes are crazy in Vietnam. I feel like this is like a halfway, like a step in that direction. But wow, it smells amazing. Look at these flowers. I don't know if they're supposed to bloom or not, but I think that's a lotus. And I, I believe that the, the lotus is supposed to represent the shape your hands make when you do this. Hello. <laughs> Ooh, that looks pretty. How much for the waffle? For one, two thousand real. Two thousand real? And what is that? Cambodian donut. Cambodian donut? Yeah, for the mm. white and palm sugar. Mm. Yeah. Okay, I'll do one. Oh, what is it? Uh, the name Bong Tong. The bean and outside sugar. And bean and coconut. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Inside, not sweet. Outside. Sugar. That's not sweet? Yeah, inside, not sweet. Ah, yeah. and this one is? Is it good? Good. It's good? All right. What? Um, that's too much. I just want like a couple pieces. You need uh, one or... Can I try a couple, like one of... Okay, uh, and half, half. Hmm? Half and half. Yeah, or maybe just like one, one, one. Yeah. Can you mix it up? That's, that's enough, that's enough. No? Just like, like one, just one or two. Yeah. One. Mm. One. Yeah. Oh. That's good. Yeah, and then I guess one of those. Okay. Uh, no more. That's that's too much. Uh, four thousand. Four thousand. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Well, it wasn't exactly the type of meal I was looking for, but at least I found something I can eat because I'm pretty starving. I haven't been eating very well since I've been in Cambodia. I think I don't want to be around all these fish. There you go, I took two. No, thank you. Yeah, thank you. There's a nice chair right here. Oh. All right. 
let's try all these snacks. So she described them all to me. I couldn't really hear that well. I'm gonna try this first. This looked the best. Cambodian donut. It's got like a glaze on it, but it's actually hard. I didn't think it was gonna be hard. Mmm. That's super good. The glaze is like, I'm not sure if it's like a coffee or a caramel, but kind of like breaks and melts in your mouth. That's really good. Mm. Definitely sweet on the outside though. It's like very sugary. It's good, I like that. Oh wow, there's like a yellow, something yellow in there. Outside I think it's coconut, like coconut sugar. Some kind of filling. It's all pretty good. It's just a little bit dry, so it's good to have water. Go back to the Cambodian donut. This one's the best. It's cool biting into it because it like breaks like glass. You can hear and feel the crunch when you bite into it. All right, so right after getting that dessert, <coughs> I walked a tiny bit further and this is where all the food is at. Those sausage things look good. Everyone's eating these soups. It looks like it's like a, like a flour soup of some kind. Oh, look at these grilled food. That looks good. I see everyone drinking this sugar cane drink. It looks different than the sugar cane I had in Thailand. So I think I'm gonna try some. These desserts look amazing. So colorful. How much is one? Four thousand. Four thousand? I'll do a big one. Oh, she put a lime in there. Ah. Thank you. Thank you. Sugar cane. Look at that. Wow, it's so sweet. Extremely refreshing. I should have got a small. This is super sweet. It's pretty dense. You really have to just walk through the streets, weaving around. Oh, every time I walk by, I smell flowers. It smells so nice. Oops, sorry. Someone's welding over there. And then you have all kinds of pigs hung up on this wall. Should I enter? All right, I'm gonna go in right here. Candy. Ooh, that looks good. Baked goods. For sure gonna get lost in here. It looks like it's multi-level, so I can go these ways or I can go up the stairs. Let's check it out. We got some powders, seasonings, I think. Oh man, there's multiple stories here. I really have no idea which way I should go, but I'm just gonna keep going up, see where this leads. Got the bugs. Okay. 
Okay. Lots of shoes behind me. Little kids' suitcases. Let's see if there's anything good in here. <laughs> Nail polish. We got the Chanel purses. Gucci. Louis Vuitton. Wow. This is really big. Hair stuff, nail stuff. Looks like they're getting fitted for a school uniform. I was just at a school teaching kids in steam week. English, super fun. And they all wore their little uniforms. Wow, this is very confusing. I think I'm gonna go back down the stairs and try to get toward the outside because I don't want to get stuck in here. The smells, the smells are kind of intense and they keep changing. Hello. What's up guys? Hello. How are you today? Okay. 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 <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> good? <laughs> Have a good day. Oh wow, look how big this is. If you look above all the stalls. Wow. Crazy. And I didn't even notice there's fans throughout all this. Okay, how do I get out? Okay, I can see the outside. Dried shrimp, dried squid. Star nice. There's so much stuff in here. It's kind of intense. I don't know how how you shop in here. Like for the locals, are they looking for good deals? Do they know where to go and go to the same place every time? I'm getting kind of dizzy. I need to get out of here. Looks like she's preparing a soup. Let's see. Ooh. She mixed broths from both those different pots. One has the meat. They always have that good rubber band technique. Wow. All right. Getting the heck out of this market. This is intense. This is wild. I can see like all across the, the edges of the roofs. There's just people walking around. I can see kids up there. <laughs> and there's just people in every direction. So many motorbikes. Like even the multiple stories of the building I was just in. You can see people hanging out up there. It is so dense. So intense. Look at these kids on the motorbikes. Cambodia. That's my first time seeing snakes on the market. <laughs> Hello. Hello. 
This girl is brave. <laughs> the street is crazy. It's literally motorbikes, just hundreds and hundreds of motorbikes all along both sides of the street. I don't know. I think it's interesting that they're all right next to each other, but <laughs> if you need to find a motorbike, this is where to go, I guess. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Have a good day. <laughs> How are you? Where are you going? <laughs> He's out. Looks like this is like a Cambodian wedding of some kind. I wonder how far I can get in. Probably not too far. This is fancy. Is this a wedding? <laughs> what, what is this? No English? I don't think I can pass by here. Okay. Hello. Is this a wedding? What is this? <laughs> Can I pass through? <laughs> well, I'm just, what is this? Um, it's a celebration. A celebration? Yeah. Oh. Um, grandfather died three years ago. Oh, I see, I see. Okay. Is it okay if I pass through? Okay, thank you. Okay. Getting lots of stairs. Thank you. Ooh. Hello. Very interesting. It sounds like it's a uh, anniversary of a funeral, um, but everyone's dressed very nice, very friendly. Interesting that they just do it right on the street somewhere. Oh, water? Thank you so much. Akon, Akon. Very nice. Wow, they really, they're very nice. Platinum premium water, sure. So I'm outside the Genocide Museum. The entire wall here. See, the entire outside wall is just totally barbed wire. It's a really thick layer of it, too. Not really sure what to expect in there. I just bought my ticket. It was $10 for my ticket. Five without audio, but I definitely want the audio. So I've got my tickets right here. I'm about to walk up front and scan my ticket. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. Scan. Right here? Okay. Right. Hello. Hello. Miss would you like? Uh, English? Please, like, only the red number to listen because you have only one hour to listen because 5 and 20. Yeah? At what time? 5.20? Yes. Please okay. come back. The audio will be closed. Okay. Select so, so like only the red number in the map to listen. Okay. I just finished up at the Genocide Museum here in Phnom Penh. And I 
can't really talk about this one. I can't really do it justice, I think. Um, but basically, there was a quarter of Cambodians who were executed and tortured. And I'm right outside one of the places where they were held and tortured. So, definitely part of history that you can visit here in Phnom Penh. Hello. Hello. <laughs> no, I'm good. Yes. <laughs> no, no, thank okay. you. Okay, thank you. All right, have a good day. <laughs> 50 cents until 6 p.m. I guess I'll stop for a beer. This place looks chill.